Butler and Martin. Backcourt guards are Lowry and Hero. And it's Adebayo in at the center, locking down the middle. And for the Rockets, the wings, Green and Brooks. The pairing up front, Smith and Shengun. And it's Van Vliet in at the point. And we know, Greg, most of the talk coming into this game focused on the front court matchup. A lot of talent in the low post here. And, you know, a lot of times that means it'll come down to the rebounding battle. Whoever controls the boards will have a big leg up in the physical and mental aspect of this game. Hero, no good. That's a shot he's got to hit. You don't get many looks better from that range. The pass to Shengu. Doesn't go for him. Great D that time from Adebayo. Lowry looking around. Pass to Adebayo. And there's Hero. That's good on the assist by Adebayo. Oh, and the touch on the interior. Hero can hit jumpers as well as capitalize in close. And last season, Greg, the Rockets tied for the league's second worst record. They expect a different outcome this go-around. Yeah, their veteran additions headlined by Fred VanVleet. Key to turning the tide, but also continued progression by their youngsters. Here's Butler following the basket by Jalen Green. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. And he just battles hard in the post. Bam doesn't need a clean look to convert from that range. For Houston, they've gone two or three here to start out the game. To the paint, here's Green. And he gets the bucket. Green's got his second bucket of the game to go. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. And you know what? They're going to keep using him. I mean, he'll be the centerpiece of their offense today. You can bank on that. Here's Lowry. Following the basket by Jalen Green. Here's Butler. Shengun with the rebound. You know, sometimes making it difficult for him to finish at the rim is all you can ask for from the defense. The 11-footer, Van Vliet, can't get it to go. Fantastic positioning there to contest that one. Yeah, I agree with you. I mean, he challenged the shot, and you can see the effects on the release of that shot. I mean, it turned a simple jumper into a tough one. Now, here is Lowry. It's deflected. Lots of athleticism for the long center. Sangoon getting it done. Van Vliet can't get it to go. He operates well in traffic, but still, that's just a tough play to finish. And it's Butler missing. Van Vliet against Lowry. Van Vliet outside. That's good from 17 feet away. And Van Vliet has the stroke to shoot from anywhere, even mid-range, when he has to. Here's Butler. And no good in the last second attempt this time. And that does it for the first quarter. Rockets lead by four. And we'll be back in just a moment with the start of the second quarter. Thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. Let's quickly break down the game we've seen so far from the Rockets, guys. You, you got to credit their defense. Communicating, rotating, making plays on the ball. They've got them rattled. It's only the first quarter, and already they've made enough big plays on defense to last really an entire game. We've got Thompson. Red Moore is out there with Green. Then there's Kevin Porter. And it's Smith in at the five. That's the five for Houston right now. You know, you'd like to see a little more effort there defensively, but maybe they wanted him to take that shot, baited him into it. Here's Thompson. They get it back. Up top, Porter. Green left side. Five to shoot over Love. And it's Green missing. The Heat trail by four. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Outside Robinson. Two minutes remaining. In the first Kicks half. it out to Love. Two minutes. Over Green. And it's Love missing. You, you almost have to assume he's going to knock those down. Oh, he is that open. And it's out of bounds. The Heat will take it the other way. Tari Eason's checked in for Smith.
And Love's got the ball here for Miami. They haven't allowed any points in the second quarter. 141 left in the first half of the game. Passes it to Jaquez for the three. Green with the rebound. Rockets leading by four. So when we're talking about team identities, uh, great. what would you say is the Miami Heat's identity? Tough-nosed, aggressive, and hard-working. Uh, that's what attracted guys like Jimmy Butler here in the first place. And that's the style of ball they want to continue playing. Right now, I'd send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. Now, heat culture seems to be a cliche, but it's not. Jimmy Butler says we never lost confidence in this group, in ourselves. We know what we're capable of. We just have to go out and prove it. We're not worried about anybody else, just the guys in our locker room, and coaching staff, ownership, management. Back to you guys. Boy, David, aren't they locked in? There's something else. Thank you. And the Rockets hiring of coach Udoka brought a lot of optimism, it seemed, to the fan base. Yeah, Houston has had a rough go in recent years. And Udoka took the Celtics to the NBA Finals in his lone season as head coach. They're not expecting that kind of success right away, but they're hopeful he can turn things in the right direction. The Rockets again can't hit. And he rushed that one, no doubt about it. The D out of position, you could see the frustration on his face. Rejected by Van Vliet. And perfect positioning from Van Vliet. Wanting to block shots whenever he can. Great instincts. Hero against Van Vliet. There's 31 seconds left now here in the second. He sinks the 11 footer. Van Vliet's got six. And unafraid to challenge the heart of this defense. Van Vliet's a strong finisher for his size. And a wide open look for Hero. Adebayo passes to Butler. Here's Hockey. No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. Eason finds Green. To the middle. Here's Shangun. Good. Great play by Green to set it up. Nice to see such unselfish play from Green putting the team ahead of himself. And some good action through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Rockets ahead, leading by four. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Kevin, thanks. Here with Jimmy Butler. Jimmy.